Why do the ADHD tag? Ah, ah, I have uh, ADD, not ADHD. I don't have the hyperness. I was diagnosed with ADHD by my psychiatrist, my, who diagnosed you? I went to a psychiatrist, psychologist. I don't know how to say that word. I went to a psychologist in Korea. It was crazy. So when they diagnosed ADHD, he put, he did a brain scan. I had to go into a machine, do a brain scan. And then I had to do an EEG. And then I had to have the EEG on my head while I did some test. Wait, you're calling, why would I lie about having ADHD? I mean, I have the papers, they're in Korean. Actually, I wanna show you guys because it's crazy. Hold on, I'm gonna grab the papers because I do wanna show you my brain scan, hold on. So, da -da -dum. okay, well, here is my brain scan report. It's only in Korean, but it's so cool. So when they did the brain scan, they talked about my, like, they have like this whole thing for the brain. So like, yeah, it's all in Korean. And then this is from the EEG, the brain waves. It's crazy because I got hit in the head really hard. Oh because of a cabinet so i was in my kitchen i had a cabinet door open i like went up and knocked my back of the head really hard and um you can see it in my scan actually so hold on it's better to see it over here so like right here where you see this red zone in the gamma is where i hit my heart head really really hard it's, it's um i can't remember so i did a he explained everything to me. It was a long time ago, though, because this test was October of 2021. I was diagnosed with ADHD. They had the EEG brain scan thingy on my head, and then I had to take a bunch of tests. And these are my scores for the test. Right here, where I am really bad, is executive function. <laughs> my executive function is, like, very, very, very low. Not good at all. And then over here is my cognitive fun uh, flexibility is really bad, but, and everything is really low, but the things I'm really good at is simple attention. So like quickly switching my attention and then my motor speed is really good. Is that why you set alarms all the time? Yes, I set an alarm almost every hour to remind me to do stuff. I wonder why that person got so mad about the ADHD tag. I don't really talk about my ADHD like ever. Cause uh, in, I don't know, like my parents were, my, not my, I shouldn't say my dad. My dad doesn't care, but my mom and like my stepdad are very like, like uh, millennials and their ADHD and their problems and stuff like that. So they were very like not happy that I went to a psychiatrist and had the psychiatrist evaluate me. And then he diagnosed me with ADHD and recommended me to take medicine. So they weren't happy. <laughs> They were kind of like, okay. So it's like really taboo. It's like a stigma almost. Like in, in my family, like my parents, like my mom and my stepdad, like my real dad, he doesn't care. He, In fact, my real dad probably has ADHD, honestly. They're very much so like, I don't know how to describe it. Like some parents, I guess, are just like, actually some parents, my parents, <laughs> they're like, um, they think like millennials and like Gen Z like cries too much and has all these problems and blah, 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 blah. And you need to deal with it yourself and you need to toughen up and no medicine, like medicine for mental problems is like super taboo in my family, you know, stuff like that. They're like that, the generational stigma, which honestly, I feel like if they didn't have that mindset and they went to psychiatrists, they would probably be a lot happier in life. They just drink, they just use alcohol. You know, that's probably, I feel like that's how boomers be though, right? Boomers are like, just drink alcohol like adults. Just quit being a baby. <laughs> drink alcohol, drink your alcohol, <laughs> like have, drink your problems away like the rest of us, quit crying. They're like, don't take medicine. Don't talk to people about it. You drink those problems away. And they would always make, they actually, my parents, my mom and my stepdad, they would always make fun of me for being really prude. Like they would be like, they would always tease me. Like my parents would be like, oh, I'm a Tara. I don't drink alcohol. <laughs> Cigarettes make me cough. And I'm like, okay guys. I'm just like, I don't, I don't want to drink alcohol. Yeah, they do. They tease me for being like too like, 
I don't know. They've always been that way, though. 